Welcome into Picks and Parlays Better's Edge. This is our Thursday night football preview. I'm Hannah Mears. That's Andrew Filipponi. We've got the Bears and Commanders. Two electric teams, to say the least, in the <laughs> NFL, I would say. Maybe we'll hope. I mean, Justin Fields had an amazing performance last week, relatively superhuman. Uh, I don't think he does that again. I would say my best bet in this one is a same-game parlay, actually. I'm going to say take the commander's money line. I think both teams are looking to bounce back after losses. However, I think the commanders are just trending in a bit more positive direction than the Bears are. Like I said, Justin Fields had a superhuman performance. I don't know if he can do that two weeks in a row, uh, especially on the road. I also like Terry McLaurin over four and a half receptions. He and Sam Howe have had a magnetic connection. It's only been getting better. He had 10 targets last week um, and pulled in eight of those. So I think he does that again. You can combine those for a little bit of a plus money parlay. That's my thought on this. But Pony, I'm really curious about yours because you were high on the Bears at one point this season. Well, you should really be interested in mine because I can't win Thursday night football if my life depended on it. So just do the exact opposite of what you're going to hear Which worked over the week, next 30 right? seconds. It did. So I am 0-4 in Thursday night games. And yes, Hannah, I am going to take the Bears uh, to cover in this game. Both teams coming off big offensive performances. You take Washington's more seriously, though, because they did it against the Eagles compared to a Denver team that had given up 70 the week before. I saw from Justin Fields, though, the type of play that I think the Bears have been anticipating and hoping for. It wasn't just him using his legs. He used the middle of the field with Cole Komet. He threw downfield to DJ Moore. He ran when it was required. Their running backs, Herbert, got more involved. So it's a big enough line. I like betting on underdogs. If I can make an argument for them to win the game, I think there's a strong enough one for Chicago, even though they haven't won in like 13 straight. Five and a half. Uh, yeah, take the Bears, but really that means take the Commanders in this game. <laughs> yeah, we're playing against Pony uh, all the time in this one, but this is Picks and Parlays, a better's edge. I'm Hannah Mears. That's Andrew Filipponi. If you want more of what we have going on, go to Picks and Parlays app. It's available on all mobile device platforms. Make sure you download that.